Celebrity Deathmatch College Edition. That's what we're talking about today. Back in the late 1990s, MTV began airing a television series known as Celebrity Deathmatch, which featured claymations of celebrities fighting each other to the death in a wrestling ring. And, of course, it would lead ultimately to one of the claymation's gruesome death. Uh, gosh, it was bloody, bones were shredded, uh, very famous celebrities that were relatively evenly matched, at least on the surface, would be put into this uh, wrestling ring to fight to the death. So why am I talking about this? I am talking about it because for many years I worked with uh, parents and students and I brought up Celebrity Deathmatch all the time when talking about how they need to construct their college lists. Uh, and unfortunately, for the last few years, I haven't really been able to do my Celebrity Deathmatch analogy as much because the younger generation just does not know much about Celebrity Deathmatch. But now that it sounds like it may be coming back, I thought it was time to dust off this old uh, tool that I used to educate students and parents alike about how to create the strongest college list for you. So Celebrity Deathmatch, the whole premise is that there are relatively evenly matched celebrities going at it in a wrestling ring until one of them knocks out the other one and literally kills the other one. And while this, of course, is quite violent imagery, uh, I always tell students that you want to create a college list with only the strongest safeties, only the strongest targets, and only the strongest reaches for you. And the only way you can do that is if you literally in your mind or on a piece of paper or on a Word document on a computer, put different colleges head to head and have them fight to the death in order to, in order to determine which colleges are the best safety options for you, which colleges are the best target options for you, and which colleges are the best reach options for you. The only way you're going to know this is if you literally write it out, put it down on paper, see what it is that matters to you most in terms of deter uh, in terms of figuring out what colleges would be a good fit for you, and then only pick the strongest, most versatile of those colleges in each of the three categories, safety, target, and reach. So that way you will have competitors that are beyond reproach, are extremely strong, and really the best options for you in the safety, target, and reach realms of your list. So again, using that celebrity deathmatch analogy where you know you could theoretically have had Britney Spears going up against Christina Aguilera, you want uh, on your list, if you're dealing with safeties, you want three safeties that are by, by all estimations, after doing a great deal of due diligence, the very best three safeties for you. But the only way you're going to determine which three are the best for you is having an initial college list of 20 safeties and winnowing it down in a very you know, competitive way, similar to Celebrity Deathmatch, which 17 are too weak and which three are the strongest for you. That, the only way you're going to know how to do that is to, to play in your mind Celebrity Deathmatch College Edition. And that way, the strongest safeties will rise to the top. Same thing with targets, same thing with reaches. So with this little primer in mind, uh, Celebrity Deathmatch College Edition, in the coming days and weeks, we'll do an occasional series where we'll play Celebrity Deathmatch College Edition where we talk about two different colleges and what I would do if I had them on my list, which one I would go to, which one I may or may not put on my list based off of different criteria. So you know sort of the thinking that goes into how to develop the best college list for you and then ultimately develop the best strategy as to which college you would attend if two very strong options present themselves at the end of the process. But in the meantime, look online, maybe YouTube, for past episodes of Celebrity Deathmatch. It's somewhat entertaining, though violent, uh, to get in the mood for these Celebrity Deathmatch college editions that we will be uh, holding over the coming weeks and months.